how much testing do you have to do? Like how much back and forth were there in terms of taste testing just to get it right? And how, how long did that take? So we've shortened the time down. Back then, the first version was easily six months. It should not take that long. There were a number of issues that led to that. And I think also something I repeat now is I wasted too much time perfecting the formula. Should have been launched after three. Just should have put it out there. It got real feedback from customers. We waited too long to get it, quote unquote, perfect. But the reality was, as soon as we started getting in the hands of customers, there was more feedback and we still made changes after the fact. So we should have just moved faster. I love that. I tell every entrepreneur, just launch it, be embarrassed of it, get the feedback. Just begin the feedback because especially with flavors, right? It's like <laughs> the market could love strawberry and then you're over here working on like, let's say lime, lemon lime. But in reality, no one likes lemon lime. And so, yeah, the feedback is super important. Kind of an interesting insight we found was early on, probably because of my scientific background, function was very much like the the highest order it was always you know we launched with a single a single flavor thinking why would people want more than one flavor <laughs> it's the best functional product with the fewest possible ingredients surely flavor doesn't matter how wrong we were people love flavor and they love hydrants flavor and so giving them that variety is really important so actually through this summer we're going to be dropping some new flavors uh, and then later this year, there'll be some new products as well that we're really excited about, but keeping tightly under wraps until, uh, until launch day. Hey everyone, thanks for checking out that clip. If you enjoyed it, be sure to hit the like button down below. And if you're interested in hearing the full episode, it's out right now on our YouTube channel. We've had a lot of great guests come on this show before, and we've got a lot of great guests coming up in the future. So hit subscribe so that you don't miss a single episode. And one final note, we're always looking for new ideas and new companies to feature on the show. So if you know of someone or know of a company, write us a comment down below letting us know who they are and what they do. We'd be happy to have them on the show. Till then, I'll just be here waiting for your comments. So, uh, see you later.